so I've decided to um, put out some of my thoughts um, as they're happening during the day today, um, Friday. Looks like uh, March 22nd at about 3.20 p.m. So I'm recording this because I didn't want to go live. But here's what my thoughts are. Uh, the world seems to be rapidly heading into a time of complete chaos and anarchy. Let's start with Brexit. Does anyone... Can anyone figure out what is going on in the UK? I know people within the UK cannot figure out what's going on. It is uh, an amazing time. I know um, that currently they have until the 13th of May to figure out if uh, they're going to be taking a hard Brexit, which means uh, they are just cut off from the European Union totally, without any plan? Or can they put together something uh, within that time frame that they can vote on one way or another and figure out uh, what's going on? I don't know. Then let's take Venezuela, the second largest city in Venezuela has just gone into complete anarchy and chaos with looting, people stealing every item of food um, off shelves. Uh, I mean, there, it's just complete anarchy. Now, Venezuela has been tossed into this craziness and we, in, looking at it, none of us can figure out I mean, the U.S. is obviously involved. Uh, the U.S. blames the Cubans, and uh, the Russians and the Chinese are on one side. Uh, the U.S. and now our best buddy, Brazil, um, have ideas, but they can't agree. The people of Venezuela are the the people of Venezuela are just in dire straits. It's craziness in Venezuela. And look at what is happening in Mozambique. <laughs> Eastern Africa, after this cyclone, the worst ever recorded. Basically, Mozambique is now underwater. Two million people are, are now stand, standing in or around a giant sea. And, uh, I mean, this is, you know, remarkable. And it is, it is a complete horror show. Now, I just learned uh, that the Mueller, Mueller investigation is coming to some sort of a head this weekend. Uh, and who knows <laughs> what's going to happen with that. I mean, uh, so we've got anarchy and then New Zealand, like the safest, calmest place in the world, just had one of the, the most intense terrorist attacks ever recorded anywhere by not Muslims, not Islamic radicals, but by white supremacists. Italy, white supremacists supremacists, white supremacists taking power, fascists taking power, Paris all the time uh, going through uh, insanity uh, on a weekly basis with basically anarchy. Um, Albania, um, Algiers, I mean, boy, I tell you, it is craziness all over the place. Australia uh, having to evacuate uh, uh, people that are in, a, in, a, in an area that is pretty unpopulated, but another cyclone um, going to um, 
uh, hit land sometime later today and kind of wreak havoc. Um, I don't know if Darwin's going to be hit, which is looks like it might be getting something. Huge amounts of rainfalls. Climate change. Political craziness and anarchy everywhere. I mean, is Trump going to be impeached? I don't know. What will all those people do that love Trump? <laughs> I mean, it's not... It's just insanity. I don't know. Something is very wrong right now. Very, very wrong. And uh, I tell you what, don't don't watch MSNBC so much. Don't watch CNN so much. Don't watch Fox News so much. Uh, uh, get outside the box, Americans. In the United States, need to get outside the box. Watch Sky News. Watch Al Jazeera. Watch 24 France. <laughs> I mean, get involved, people. This is, you know, you, you better, you better start <laughs> uh, put some water aside and some things to eat because um, I have no idea. Uh, but it seems to me that the world is basically in chaos. What are you going to do about it? I don't know. It's pretty pretty easy to for all of us to kind of avoid. Stick our heads in the sand. But not listen when I mean, you know, not listen to what's really going on and uh, be a part of this foxholing of tribal tribal humanism that we, we just go down and we can't we just cannot think outside the box it's it's not the evil Democrats it's not the it's not the Trump magna hat people it's there's something way deeper than all of this and uh, I don't know where are we gonna go is this um, the Fermi paradox happening as we speak I mean, is this why we don't see civilizations out there in the universe? We don't hear them. Because they get to this point, and we've only been to this point for 100 years. They get to this point, and everything unravels. Everything unravels, and they self-destruct. You know, in 1965, I was hiding under my, tape, my uh, desk in the elementary school, uh, being told that it was for an earthquake or... The Russians, or the Soviets, not the Russians, the Soviets, were going to nuke us. What is going on? If you don't think this is crazy, you've probably, been, you've probably just been born this century, because uh, I could tell you, I thought the 60s were crazy. Uh, this, is, uh, go, this is beyond that, beyond that, the by a magnitude, man. This is this is remarkably ins insane. So the have-nots and the haves, and corporations or individuals. What is what the fuck is going on? Anyway, good luck to you all. <laughs> maybe I'll maybe I'll be back on later. Maybe I won't have electricity later tonight. Who knows? Anyway, take care. Bye.